have to discuss about the role of sociologist uh, as a teacher everybody knows teacher is a uh, dominant career of the sociologist in addition to the concern and the problem of teaching in any problem the problem of neutrality versus value of commitment in a particular acute questions the teacher uh, whatever uh, kind of class he has he needs to be very clear he needs to be uh, neutral he shouldn't be biased about any phenomena if uh, he is going to observe some student it could be a student it could be a phenomenon it could be any kind of a situation what's happening in the class so the person who is uh, standing in the class should be biased if you are going to predict a students if you are going to predict uh, the level of their performance and if you are uh, going to make a comparison between two students it could be a top student could be a bottom students or it could be uh, or observations could be around one or two students or two or more students there is a, a the prerequisite requirement that the teacher should be neutral and should be biased from all kind of a perspectives the teacher mind should be refrained from all conscious things but should they tell society how it should be used the fundamental question uh, is whether the science specifically sociology should be value free for example sociologists uh, know some things about population growth race relations urban development and many others matter involving public policy questions so early sociologists gave us sports uh, to all sports sort of public policies they believed in between uh, if we talk about between 1920 and 1940s or uh, maybe more many sociologists shifted to the view that sociology should be a more nearly pure science discovering knowledge rather than attempting to you know uh, something that uh, have some kind of a matching and how and and the idea is that how it can be used they sought to build sociology on the model of the physics as value free from all aspects or you can say it should be free from all kind of biasness so it should be committed to no value is expect free from scientific inquiry so whatever the uh, teacher have a mind their mind should be uh, unbiased and if they are going to observe any kind of a phenomena their place is like they should be a neutral person on that particular stage of observations so that was